Hello everyone, today I will be showing you how to install Windows 7 or Windows 8 on a MacBook Pro. So it will be either with a CD or a USB. So you want to go to utilities, boot cap assist, and press continue. And first, you want to do create Windows 7 or latest version install disk in no USB. So you just press continue. Just let me play. And then you just find the Windows ISO image, which is here, that I will put in the link below, and you put it on your USB. And to do it on a CD, what you do is go to Applications, uh, Utilities, Disk Utility, and here will be the disk, and you just put Burn, and you also put the ISO image. So now I'm so now we have to download the latest Windows support for Mac. So you also go here to Utility, Utilities, and Boot Camp Assist. Press Continue. And then you just want to download the latest Windows support software for Apple. You can burn it either on a CD, or a DVD, or paste it on an external drive. I have already done so in an external drive on my USB, so I'm not going to do this. So go back. Now that we have everything, we will install Windows 7. So here you want to choose the amount of or space you want in your Windows. I would choose 65 since I will be using Windows for gaming. So beware that Windows by itself would occupy 20 GB, so you will least need 30. So now I'm going to stop the recording here and I'm going to go to my camera. Just press install. So you make sure you have your USB or your CD with the Windows 7 connected to your Mac. So it will reboot from it. So you want to choose ultimate 64 bit. If your computer is 32 bit, just choose that one. So next, accept license terms and next, and you want to put custom. And here you want to choose the partition we just made, but first we need to format it. So press OK and just press next, and it will start installing. So now it's done, just write the name of your computer, next, password, so here for the product key, I will put the, uh, the one in the description, so you can write it down.
so the serial key will be in the in the description so just copy and paste it there and press next so use recommended settings you just want to put your time So yeah, this is another you can change this after. Let's just finalize it. So now what you want to do is put the USB or CD with the Microsoft Windows support me for Mac. So I'm just gonna put the USB. So just open the folder, Windows support, and you want to put the setup. Just put setup, yes, and then it will start installing. Set the equipment, next, and install. So that's it guys, it's finished. So now we have to install it. Yes. So there we go guys, it's done. Thanks for watching. If you want to know how to install Windows using Parallels, I will put the description below. And also to change the startup. So because right now, when you um, start your computer, it will automatically go to Windows. So you just want to go to System and Security, Boot Camp, yes, and change this to Macintosh. So when you uh, start your computer, it will automatically go to Windows. I mean to Mac, sorry. So yeah. So also here I will show you how to change from Mac to from Mac to Windows. So you turn it on and then you press the option key. You press it, you keep pressing it until this comes out and then you choose if you want Windows or Mac or just Windows. So thanks guys for watching. Please rate, comment and subscribe.